Hi, y'all. How's everybody doing? I hope you're doing wonderful. I know I have been gone for quite some time. I can't even tell you how long I've been gone for. It's been a long time, right? So this is the first time I'm sitting at my desk in my craft room in a long time. But um, probably about a month ago, I finished the journal and I have not been in here since. So I hope it all looks good. <laughs> um, I am using, see, I don't even have anything to get any of my information together. I believe it's Ruby and Pearls. Yes, it is Angel's Kit and an Angel's Add-on Kit um, that I used for this journal. And like I said, I finished it probably about a month or so ago. And I just want to do a video. It is available. It is a flip-flop journal. We have this beautiful sari. I always flat iron my sari because it comes just so messed up, right? So I flat iron my, my sari. So we have this tag. Look at this sari. I just love floppy bows like that, right? We could use a little charm hanging from here, couldn't we? Hmm. I don't think I have one. But that's a good idea. So our first page here is a beautiful angel with this pocket and tag. And look at the pretty butterflies. So we got pocket here. Isn't that pretty? Uh, we got some crunchy there, right? Every, everything is so pretty. So yeah, I have the baby today, but he's napping. And I'm like, I need to go in there and make a video. This is from an old, it's called Sew It, S-E-W-I-T. It's a big old Sew It book. It's pretty old. Here's two pockets here. You can stick a couple of things in. Um, I have some vintage papers in here from books, you know, book pages in here. And then some, some paper, dictionary page. Love that sound. I miss it. I miss that sound. Uh, here we go. We got some collage going on. So that's your first signature. And then we come to this big pot. We have some lace here. And this is a pocket, but it's for something really thin. But here's a nice deep pocket that you can keep some treasures or some pictures in. Isn't that, I love that. But yeah, see how this won't fit. And that, it's, it's small. I just wanted a lace effect. So here's our second signature. Look at that collage. I love it. Using some of my Tim Holtz people. I have a lot. And then here's another one of those same lace, which doesn't have to be a pocket, but I did leave, you know, the center open in case you wanted to see. It could hold a pen if you're writing, but we got this going on. So I'm trying to slowly get back in my craft room. I've just been away for so long and I feel I feel like I'm going to lose everything that I know by being away for so long. But I've got some family issues going on, as some of you know. I printed this. This is a page from the kit, and I printed it on vellum. And then a little collage there. But um, here's the center. Isn't it pretty? I put this butterfly here. Another Tim Holtz people. And there's the other side of that. Isn't that so vibrant? Right? I love printing on vellum. And then look at that. Isn't that pretty? Another tag here. And all the tags. I want to say all the tags you can write on the back. I think I left them all blank. To do a little bit of writing. See? And here's a little tuck spot and some paper. If you want to write on that or put some family pictures. This is paper clipped in. 
and you have a tag with the back that you can write on and then you open this up and you can do some writing in here if you wanted to but I vintage that up so isn't that pretty I love those colors so here we go to the third uh, see, I'm forgetting things already. I just love that collage. It's so simple. And then here's a tag within a tag. Isn't that cool? I love lace. Love using lace in unexpected ways. So there is a little bit of writing in here as far as, you know, some blank pages for you. This is on vellum as well. And then this is the same pretty blue flower. Oh, we open it from this side. It's the opposite side is the last one. We got some shorthand going on here. Love that. I don't think they had shorthand as a subject when I was a kid. I don't remember seeing it. They may have. They had typing class though. I love that heart. Here. We got so many pretty pictures in here with these tags, right? So there's that. And then here's our fourth signature. So here's a lace pocket. See, this has a coffee dyed, it's a coffee dyed file folder that I turned into tags. And I love these. These are so cute. I used, um, what's it called? A brad, a little brad. I've got some lace and a couple of tags. Put a little piece of lace there. So it's a triple tag. And then look, love this. Texas, pretty flower, roses. And then here we have one of these. So we have one of these in each of the three large signatures. Oh, look, there we go. And then we have some pretty lace up here. Isn't that just so pretty? And lace down here. Love it. Look, Logan. It says Logan. That's how, that's uh my one of my nephews son uh nephew's name. But it's see phone Logan. See how the phone number is different? I think that's how old this is. There's the center of this signature you have writing on there. There's some writing there. So pretty. Love that. This is from 1910. It's a digital. Look how pretty this is. Tag within a tag and look at that. All right, I think this opens up. Yep, I just tore it. So it should open up, but part of it's glue. So I am going to fix that. So we have a belly band inside here. Let's let's get this because it was too close, and that's why it ripped. Feels good with the paper in between my hands. And then you have all this to write on. Got some old vintage music there. So there you go, right back to the beginning. So I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope I didn't lose too many of my followers by being gone for so long. But I'm gonna try to get back in the craft room 
and especially with it being Christmas time. Christmas time is my favorite time. Let me even this out some. Oops. Christmas time is my favorite time for making journals. I just love all of the pretty Christmas kits that are out there. So I will be working with one in particular. My favorite, my bestie, Doreen at Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. I will be playing with her Christmas kit when it comes out. I'm anxiously waiting for that because it's just going to be gorgeous. Gorgeous. All her stuff is gorgeous. So uh, you'll see me again. I'm slowly going to be getting back into the craft room. And um, hopefully I didn't forget too much. So thanks for hanging out with me. If you are interested in this flip-flop journal, you can send me an email. It's down below. Or you can private message me on Facebook or Instagram. And if you do any one of those, if you are interested in it, please also leave me a comment down in the comment section so I can be sure to look for your email or your private message. You know, that stuff goes to junk um, a lot of the time and I don't check my junk. <laughs> so, so let me know. All right. Thank you. God bless. And I will see you in the next one. Bye y'all.